Okay, so I drew out this lemon and I added masking um, fluid to where I, where I wanted to keep it white. And these are the colors I want to use. I want to use um, lemon yellow and cobalt teal. But I'm trying to figure out how to make it so it doesn't turn green. It's a little green. That's okay. This isn't too bad. It's kind of blue. So it might turn into a lime. We'll see. I think I'm just going to dive right into it. And then be full of regret later. Okay, let's do it. I'm really nervous to do this. Just do it. Okay. I'm gonna have thick yellow outline. I should do that later. Probably. Should do like a white, a light yellow wash over everything. Or not. I really should have planned this out a little better. That's okay. Yep, there's some green. I think it's gonna happen. Okay, so the uh, cobalt teal didn't dry as light as I thought it would. It's kind of dark right now. I'm getting hit by inspiration otherwise. And I really want to paint, otherwise I would have waited to do it during the day. So you can tell the colors are what better. I did a few swatches before I started, but nothing too serious. So I'm also using um, 
Arches uh, cold press watercolor paper in my experience with it previously I did use a different paint though was that it um, made the colors dry lighter and duller than I wanted but I'm not having that effect right now as far as I can tell So far, I'm not really liking the water, the Arches watercolor paper. I haven't really tried it too much. Just doesn't erase very well. I think that's probably my biggest problem with it. And I probably should have tried it um, more before I bought four pads of paper. It's not like I won't use them anyway. So because the uh, teal is drying um, darker than I thought, or at least that's what it appears to be doing, I think I'm going to have to um, use um, more vibrant shade of yellow than I had been intending. That's fine. I have to wait for it to dry in between um, steps. I usually hit it with a blow dryer. That makes the uh, masking fluid uh, peel up, so just have to wait. Actually, I guess I could do the Orion while we wait. There's actually some blue in the Rhine too. I can plan that part out. Okay, we'll just, just make something up. There's not actually really, well, I guess faintly there's a little bit of blue. Not really, but the tone of the paper I'm using, I'm using one of the tones that I see in the image. I'm painting all of that tone blue. I didn't put any masking fluid on the rind, so I think I'm just going to go back over it later and hit it with um, a Posca pen. Do I have the time now where I could do the background? I don't know if I want to do that. I think I'll just do a little light wash. Background is also going to be teal. It'll be a um, more intense teal than the rest, so that it really um, contrasts with the yellow. I'm going to do a light wash of it now. I'll probably come back and hit it with a darker wash later. Maybe. Just closer to the edges with the darker. I said it in another video, I'll say it again. I've been considering lately that if I don't like how something turns out, I can always repaint it later. Just consider it. Practice, if that's the case. It's really been taking the edge off of um, trying to get everything perfect the first time. I 
actually getting pretty good control with this giant brush. I didn't think I would. Okay, I like that. Since I'm only using two colors, and um, when you do watercolor, you have two cups, one for rinsing off the dirty water, um, the paintbrush, and then one for collecting clean water, which to paint with. And since I'm using two colors and I'm trying to keep them separate, I'm using one um, cup just for the blue, for the teal, and then the other cup just for the yellow. And I'm still somehow getting green. So then I'm going to have to let that dry. It's going to take a while and then I'll paint it yellow. So I walked away, I let it dry for a little bit and I came back and I realized I didn't do the middle. Try to use maybe a little bit of yellow gouache to cover these up right here. Not opaque enough. I guess that's okay. Okay, this part I actually hate. I hate taking the rubbing it. Oh, it's not fun. I don't like uh, rubbing my fingers on the texture of the paper. I don't like the little mess it makes afterwards. That's why I like the pasta pen so much. But I think my pasta pen is empty at the moment. To get a new one. Sorry.
think it actually goes like that, doesn't it? I guess it doesn't matter. I guess I can leave it like that. I just don't know where to sign it. Originally I had it like that. We'll just say it's like that. There we go. Ah. Yeah, okay. This is something I want I'm gonna want to try again I like it I think I want to do it again I have this idea in my head and I mean this color palette I guess I just can't enact it the way that I see it in my mind anyway thank you for watching Please comment down below um, what your favorite fruit is, I suppose. When I was little, I used to eat the whole lemon, even the peel. Um, like this uh, video if you like, and uh, subscribe if you'd like to see more. Goodness, I'm tired. I should have done this um, not at midnight. I'm done for real.